So in order for, uh, for us to welcome everyone and also to give you a brief uh, introduction, we have a, a very well-known person with us. Professor Priyan Mendy, is a, he's a professor attached to the Department of uh, Infrastructure Engineering, University of Melbourne, uh, with over 400 academic publications. Very warm welcome. We have some, uh, in fact, uh, very distinguished people as well, and very qualified people, uh, and so we'll have a very good forum. And this is the, it's the first forum, uh, as, uh, as uh, Shanaka mentioned. First one was in London a uh, few months back, and this is the second one outside, uh, outside Sri Lanka. So it's really, uh, today I'm going to, because I want, we want to have an open forum rather than uh, us talking too much. So, uh, in fact, uh, the, uh, it is just a very, very brief introduction. Actually, it's a, it's a, it's a network of uh, in fact, academics, uh, professionals, and entrepreneurs, uh, again, who love the country and wish to contribute uh, actively towards the development of a uh, prosperous Sri Lanka. So what is the main objective of today? This is put in few words and um, uh, to say that it's an effective and recognized organization conducting an intellectual dialogue and interact with uh, Vyatmaga Sri Lanka Executive Committee to act as a conduit uh, to convey good ideas for development of Sri Lanka. So we are starting with all that today. We are starting to put these good ideas. Uh, and it's really like a starting a, uh, a dialogue now. It's really open forum, getting ideas, interacting with them, and then passing that. Before what happened was, I know that we were trying, and we all have tried last time, not by 25, 30, uh, more than that here in Australia. I have tried, but it's very, uh, I find, found it difficult to pass the messages directly. We had good ideas, but they were not going directly there. But this could be an opportunity for us. We try our best uh, to really pass those messages. So that's the idea of the main objective of the forum here. So that's a common idea. This really start with uh, some of the things that uh, I'm interested in personally. So. Uh, like you know, these areas, uh, you don't need to read, but you know, I do a bit of work on AI, the artificial intelligence, to robotics, uh, some interest in the printing, intelligent transport solutions. We have organized a forum uh, on the 25th uh, in, in, um, in Colombo uh, to really talk about uh, the traffic congestion. I know it's a big problem in there, so we are starting on the 25th, uh, Mr. Premasiri, the uh, is the secretary of the highways and transport will be there to hold the uh, like, no, whole forum and we'll talk about good ideas in the intelligent transport solutions. There are two people from uh, Sydney helping me. They are going there. Uh, one is going there, one is going from Skype. Very experienced uh, too. So what they want there is to really some ideas, good ideas coming from uh, around the world. So the first one we are doing it and uh, so on. So we Australia can contribute a lot like that. So already starting from on the, on the 25th. So things are happening. Innovative materials, biotechnology, medical services, it's not uh, directly mine, but these are some other ideas. Agriculture, there are experts here, construction innovation. So these are some, uh, like no, closer to me, but uh, it's some of the, there are many other areas that we are going to, to talk today. Now, uh, so I think that uh, I'll conclude that uh, uh, very brief introduction to, to the VF model. We have another uh, renowned person here with us uh, to address you next. Uh, he's uh, Mr. Gamini Pereira, uh, OAM, and uh, he's the founder, president of uh, the SCATS, which is uh, another one of the uh, uh, earliest or the first uh, Sri Lankan uh, organizations to form in Australia in when trying to contribute and trying to bring all the professionals together. So, uh, yeah, he'll be uh, addressing you next. Uh, now, I will. Just uh, highlight few uh, f uh, clippings of uh, His Excellency President Gota by Rajapaksha about Vyatmaga uh, concept. <laughs> Vishayan ma viyatma ka salas me viyatma ka sankhal pe pasu ke janat pe tuvenedi hatanama lakshya ka janata ma 
ඡන්දය දීමට උනන්දු කරනවා ඔබ දන්නවා ශ්‍රී ලංකාවේ දේශපාලන බැලුවාම නොයෙක් නොයෙක් කාලවලදී දේශපාලනඥයන් නොයෙක් විදිය දේශපාලන ව්‍යාපාර මනාප චන්ද්‍ර ක්‍රමයත් එක්ක නොයෙක් දේශපාලන ක්‍රම කරලා තමයි ඡන්දය ලබා ගන්නේ නමුත් මේ ජනාධිපතිතුමාට පුළුවන්කමක් වුණා ව්‍යාත්මක තුලින් නියම දර්ශනයක් සමාජයේ ඉදිරිපත් කරලා ඒ තුලින් ජයග්‍රහණය කරන්න දැන් රටේ තියෙනවා විවස්ථාදායක හා විධායක අතර ලොකු ගැටුමක් ඒ නිසා මෙම පරමාර්ථයන් ව්‍යාත්මක තුලින් ඉදිරිපත් කරන පරමාර්ථයන් ක්‍රියාත්මක කිරීමේ බැරිකමක් තියෙනවා රටට ඇවිල්ලා එහෙමනම් අපි විවස්ථාදායක පාර්ලිමේන්තුව තුළ ශක්තිමත් කර යුතුය එහෙම කරන්න බෑ ඒ ඒක හැම මැතිවරණයකින් තමයි ඒක කෙරෙන්න ඕනේ ඒක නිසා වියතුන් පාර්ලිමේන්තුවට යවී මේ වැදගත්කම මේ වියත්මක මගින් ඔබට පෙන්වලා තියෙනවා ඒක නිසා ඕස්ට්‍රේලියාවේ ජීවත් වෙන අපිට කරන්න පුළුවන් එකක් තමයි ලංකාවේ ඉන්න අපේ හිතවත් නෑදෑයන්ට හැම මැතිවරණයකදීම වියතුන් පාර්ලිමේන්තුව නියනි කියන එක උනන්දු කරනවා එතකොට තමයි එතන වෙනසක් ඇති වෙන්නේ මොකක් අහන්න පුළුවන් ඇයි අපි කොහොමද ඕස්ට්‍රේලියාව ඉඳලා අපේ එහෙ ජනාධිපතිතුමාගේ ජයත් ශක්තිමත් කරන්න කියලා කරන්න පුළුවන් විදි තියෙනවා නොයෙක් විදින් ටෙලිෆෝන් එකෙන් දුරකත එතකොට ඊමේල් වලින් කතා කරලා ඒ අදහස් වෙනස් කරන්න පුළුවන් මොකද අවුරුදු ගානක තුන් දේශපාලන පරිසරය පැවිසි හතරෙන් නැත්නම් දවස් ගානක මාසිකම වෙනස් කරන්න බෑ කාලයක් යනවා ඒ අපේ ඡන්ද ක්‍රමයේ අපේ දේශපාලන රටා වෙනස් කරන්න සෑහෙන කාලයක් ලංකාවේ යනවා ඒකට දැම්ම ඉඳලා අපිට මේ වියත්මකට සම්බන්ධ වෙලා ඒ අයට දැනුම මේ වෙනස පෙන්වන්න පුළුවන් නම් මම හිතනවා ඒක තමයි අපි මේ ඕස්ට්‍රේලියාවේ ජීවත් වෙලා ඉන්න අයගේ කරන්න පුළුවන් ලොකුම යුතුයකම කියලා. ඔච්චර දැනම් නිස්තුතියි. We have uh, uh, Dr. Sarath Thukwatha. He is a lecturer at RMIT uh, and also the C also a senior vice president of SCATS. We are offering work integrated learning uh, facilities for our students. We send them at least one year to the industry and work in industry and get uh, the experience and come back to uni. We are, we are following up them and we are giving credits for them for their gathering experience. They are just not taking, go they are not going through the textbooks, rather than they are going out and experience the field of their studies. So this is from, I'm telling from the business school. I believe, I know, other faculties will do the same thing, the other faculty that I mentioned. So uh, as a small idea, we can, there'll be a lot of professionals and a lot of knowledgeable people here so this idea can be uh, put into a pools like sector based specialized pools and then we can when we get an opportunity we can sh send these ideas to our country when we visit our country we can go to universities and talk to them and help them to design their degree programs in a way we can uh, we can employ our graduates once they graduate from the universities uh, we are so, very uh, honored to have uh, former uh, Speaker of the Victorian Parliament, uh, Mr. Thelmo Langwell. I believe that Professionals for Better Future is a great initiative. A nation cannot be built without yourselves, and you know it, particularly as scholars and academics. I believe that you, of all countries in the region, can become the Knowledge Nation Hub for the region. And we are very grateful to uh, Dr. Mika Sattar. He has to look after the UN delegation today, UNESCO delegation. But uh, in the middle of that, he is going to, to join us. But uh, when you appoint people to the parliament, right, always trying to appoint professionals who love the country. In other words, professionals plus patriotic people. In other words, P plus P. P plus P people we need, that is professional plus patriotic people. Just because you are professional, if you are not patriotic, the country is useless. So both P plus P must be there. Uh, so uh, Mr. Hemant Rohita is a scientist, currently is the chairman of the technology committee of SCATS. I feel we have to change our culture. Uh, thinking culture in Sri Lanka for us to uh, be an advanced uh, uh, economy in, in, the, uh, in the world. So 
I have uh, jotted down a few ideas which uh, uh, may be of some use at some stage, which were, I will, um, I have said here, um, uh, Billy, have an innovative culture uh, and it has to be publicized and uh, brought into people's minds uh, like uh, innovation is future. That sort of thing is not, I don't think it is uh, really happening. We need to bring that uh, idea of innovation from their very young age, from the kindergarten level, and introduce the innovation in the schools, uh, study of innovations, have frequent discussions in the uh, television and uh, compulsory newspapers. Uh, yes, we can start from, uh, yeah, I mean, yes, uh, you can, do you want, you can identify yourself. In Australia, we have plumbers, electricians, and various trades, even even cleaning uh, profession. There are people who are truly excel in, as entrepreneurs in Sri Lanka, in Australia. So we want to initiate something like it in Sri Lanka as well, and we have already initiated that program with some institutions. We want to enhance on that one and make sure that we we uh, continue to coordinate with Australia giving Australian examples back there and uh, share our knowledge with them and make it a good successful program in the years to come.